We at the Mugoi Dwa Secondary School in Buwani Limpopo, where about 61 grade 12 learners have been coming three times a week for about two hours where they've been helping each other study just to prepare for the start of this academic year. We've spoken to uh, school management of the record who've assured us that this is in no way uh, going against the basic education department's uh, decision to postpone the start of this academic year, saying that there is no teacher in sight and even the school management hasn't been coming, it's just the learners coming here to assist them, to assist each other with their parents also here keeping the school clean ensuring that there's uh, 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 adherence to lockdown regulations where the learners are sanitized before entering classes and ensuring that there is social distancing in the classrooms. But to hear more about what has been happening, we are going to speak to two learners. One of them the first one is Ronewa Matsira Ronewa I've seen you writing on the chalkboard trying to assist other learners. Why are you here? Um, we are here to help each other understand more. And um, other learners don't have cell phones, laptops, so they, we cannot have online classes. And we are short of gadgets. So we are here to help each other and their parents who make sure there's social distancing and help us with sanitizing. But I'm sure you have big dreams. This is your final year of after taking 12 years in high school. I'm sure you have dreams. What are you hoping for next year? Um, I really want to be an actress, but I help other learners with history because other learners want to study law. Yeah. To bring in another view, we are joined by Hangui Kangui. Kangui. You know, your peers are at home, schools haven't uh, opened yet. I'm sure there are reasons you are here. Um, for me, the 15th of February does not make sense for that. During March, we have to write our term one examinations. So we have chose to come back to schools and use um, these schools as a learning area. We have not opened, we are here as as learners, we are here to assist each other. As myself, I am good in economics. Sometimes I will stand over there and help them with economics. So we are, cho we are using these schools as um, some sort of a library, if I may say. Yeah. But I'm sure you also have big dreams. What are you hoping for next year? What are you aware? Which university are you applying for? What are you hoping to become? As I've seen that I am good in economics, I have then went to the internet and searched what I might do. So I'm thinking I would go to the University of Vets and study and become economics. I hope that maybe someday I might be the Reserve Bank Governor. That's very good. Come, we thank you so much. Uh, we, for now, would like to come back in studio, but you know, we've seen a lot of these learners and we've seen the dedication that they've put in. These are rural learners where some of us tell us that they go for days without electricity and they don't have smart gadgets where they cannot do any online learning. But they've given their time to ensure that they are caught up and that by the time schools resume, they are able to be on par with, our, with their peers in other schools throughout the country. But for now, it's back to you in studio.